Your person has reached a significant turning point in their emotional journey, one that they've likely resisted for quite some time. Until recently, they have been struggling to acknowledge their true feelings for you. They may have tried to rely on rationality, logic, or even scientific reasoning to suppress or ignore their emotions, convincing themselves that it was easier to stay detached and uninvolved. They might have pushed away any genuine emotions or romantic inclinations that arose, fearing what those feelings could mean for them and their current life circumstances. But now, after a long period of emotional suppression, they are beginning to accept the truth, they are processing their feelings for you, and they can no longer deny the depth of their affection. While they have reached a point of clarity about how they feel, it's important to note that they may still not be ready to communicate these emotions openly. They now know, without question, that they have fallen completely in love with you, but this realization is still overwhelming. The weight of their feelings is something they're grappling with, and even though they may want to express it, fear, uncertainty, or even shame might hold them back. This emotional awakening is happening internally, but externally, they continue to maintain a cold, distant demeanor. When they are around you, they may put on a facade of indifference or detachment, as if nothing has changed. Yet, beneath that surface, they are struggling with a whirlwind of emotions, knowing that their love for you is real but unsure of how or when to express it. One of the main reasons for their hesitation could be tied to their current life situation. For some of you, your person may be dealing with a third-party involvement, whether that be another romantic relationship, a commitment they made to someone else, or some form of attachment that makes it difficult for them to break free. This external factor complicates their emotional journey even more, as they feel torn between honoring their current obligations and following their heart, which is undeniably drawn to you. The longer they stay entangled in this other situation, the harder it becomes for them to come forward. They may be feeling a great deal of guilt or confusion about how to navigate their way out of this commitment, fearing the consequences for everyone involved. At the same time, the growing emotional distance between you two is starting to weigh heavily on them. They're noticing that, while they are caught in their emotional turmoil, you are moving forward with your life. You're not waiting around for them, and this realization is making them panic internally. They may fear that their hesitation and delay in addressing their feelings have cost them the chance to be with you. There's a sense of urgency now, a recognition that if they don't take action soon, you may slip away. They can see that you are doing well on your own, both emotionally and financially. They admire your strength, independence, and the fact that you have not been defined by this situation. You appear powerful, self-assured, and successful, which only deepens their feelings of admiration and love for you. However, this also adds to their internal struggle. On one hand, they are in awe of your strength and ability to thrive without them, but on the other hand, they may feel insecure or inadequate, wondering if they still have a place in your life. The contrast between their emotional chaos and your apparent stability can be intimidating, making it even harder for them to come forward. They may feel that by the time they are ready to speak their truth, you will have already moved on, leaving them behind. Despite all of this, your person is likely to reach out and communicate with you soon. The sadness they feel from staying away and pretending their feelings don't exist is becoming unbearable. They are finding it increasingly difficult to maintain the cold, detached front they've been presenting. Expect some form of communication from them this month, whether it be an attempt to explain their situation or an effort to reconnect with you on a deeper level. Even if they are not fully ready to lay all their emotions bare, there's a strong chance that the weight of their feelings will push them to reach out, signaling the beginning of a more honest and vulnerable dialogue between the two of you. In the meantime, 
it's clear that they see you as a beacon of strength and independence, someone they admire deeply. While their journey to fully express their love may still take time, the realization of their feelings for you is no longer something they can ignore. How they choose to handle this internal transformation remains to be seen, but the signs of an upcoming breakthrough in communication are strong. How are you doing today? I've been thinking about you a lot, wondering if your day went smoothly. Was everything okay? Is there anything that happened that you want to share with me? You don't even have to say it out loud if you don't feel like it, just think about it, and somehow, I'll hear it. Our connection runs that deep. I can feel your thoughts, even from a distance. You're always on my mind, and there's a constant stream of conversation between us in my head. It's as if you're here with me, wherever I go. I find myself talking to you silently, sharing random moments of my day or thoughts that pop into my mind. It's funny how, even when I'm focused on something important, I'll still catch myself thinking about you. It feels natural, like you're a part of me, always there in the background of my thoughts. I love how close that makes me feel to you, as if there's this invisible thread connecting us, no matter the distance. You're such a beautiful soul, inside and out, and I cherish that connection we share. Right now, I find myself longing to hear from you, to see a glimpse of your world. Maybe post something on your social media? You know I'm always watching, eager for any little sign of you. I love to scroll through your profile, looking at your pictures. It gives me this comforting feeling, like you're not as far away as it sometimes feels. There's something special about seeing your face, even in a picture. It feels like a bridge between us, a reminder that we're still connected, even when we're apart. I often open your profile and just stare at your photos, imagining that you're right there with me. It's almost as if I can reach out and touch you, even though I know you're not physically present. It's one of those things that keeps me going when the distance feels hard. You know, at night, when the world quiets down, I often find myself looking up at the sky. There's something about the stars and the moon that makes me think of you. It's as if they remind me of the vastness of the universe and the deep connection we share stretching across all that space between us. When I gaze up at the night sky, I picture us together under those same stars. I imagine us lying side by side, making love, holding each other close, and sharing the warmth and comfort of being together. Those moments play in my mind like scenes from a dream, and they fill me with a sense of peace. Even though we're apart, it feels like we're together in those moments. I love you so much. You are so beautiful, not just in how you look, but in your heart, your mind, your spirit. I love everything about you, the way you think, the way you feel, the way you care. There's something so special about you, something that draws me in deeper every day. One of the things I love most about you is your vulnerability. When you allow yourself to open up, to show me that raw, unfiltered side of you, it gives me such a profound sense of fulfillment. It's in those moments that I feel closest to you, that I see your true strength and beauty. You don't need to hide any part of yourself from me. Don't be afraid to be vulnerable, to show me your fears, your doubts, your pain. It only makes me love and respect you more. There's something incredibly satisfying in knowing that you trust me enough to share that part of yourself with me. You mean so much to me, more than words could ever express. I want you to know that I'm here for you, always. I'm thinking of you, talking to you, loving you, even when we're not physically together. I respect you deeply, not just for who you are, but for everything you bring into my life. You make me feel more alive, more connected, 
more in tune with myself and the world around me. I can't wait until we're together again, until I can hold you in my arms and tell you all these things in person. Until then, know that you are always with me in spirit, in my thoughts, in my heart. I love you just as you are, and that love will never fade. We've never experienced a connection like this before. From the moment we met, there was something unexplainable between us, something deep and profound. I've always felt that. But I know that lately, my behavior has caused you a lot of confusion and maybe even doubt. I can see why you would question whether I feel the same way you do. It's understandable. I haven't been as open as I should have been, and I realize now that my actions may have made you wonder if I truly care for you as much as you care for me. The truth is, I acted like I was emotionless around you because I was afraid. I didn't want you to know just how deeply I feel about you. I was terrified that if I let my guard down and showed you the intensity of my emotions, it might push you away or make things more complicated between us. So, instead, I held back. I put on this mask of indifference, pretending that my feelings were not as strong as they really are. But I know now that doing this only created distance between us, and for that, I'm deeply sorry. I've been thinking a lot about how you must be feeling right now. I know that you're probably feeling disconnected from me, like there's this growing space between us. And it pains me to think that I've caused you to feel that way. But I want you to know that, despite how things may seem on the surface, I've never felt distant from you. Even in the moments when I seemed detached or cold, I was always thinking of you. I've never withdrawn my energy from you, not for a single moment. I've been with you in spirit, always connected, always feeling close to you. Our connection is unlike anything I've ever known, and I believe it's something that goes beyond what most people can understand. It's not just about physical attraction or the kind of love that's easy to explain to others. It's a soul connection, something that can only be felt between two people who are truly meant for each other. I've tried to explain it to myself, but words always seem to fall short. It's not the kind of bond that can be put into simple terms. It's something that exists on a deeper level, something that defies logic or explanation. When I'm with you, it feels like everything makes sense, like we were meant to find each other in this vast world. I know that others might not fully grasp what we have, but that's okay. Our connection doesn't need to be understood by anyone else. It's ours alone. It's something that we feel in our hearts and souls, something that doesn't require validation from the outside world. And no matter what challenges we face, no matter what doubts or fears arise, I believe in the strength of this connection. Nothing and no one can take it away from us. Lately, I've been feeling incredibly nostalgic about us. I keep replaying all the moments we've shared in my mind, thinking about the laughter, the conversations, the quiet moments where words weren't necessary. I've been longing to go back to those times, to recapture that sense of closeness we once had. There's so much I want to say to you, so many things I've been holding back. I know I've kept my feelings bottled up for too long and it's time to finally be open and honest with you about how much you mean to me. I've also been doing a lot of reflection, and I've realized that I need to make some changes. I'm learning and growing, trying to understand how I can be a better partner to you, how I can nurture this relationship in the way it deserves. I'm working on building new ways to express myself, to be more open and vulnerable with you. I'm learning how to manifest the kind of life we both dream of, the life we've talked about so many times. I want to create that future with you, to build something lasting and beautiful. This connection we share is something rare and precious, and I don't want to let fear or doubt come between us. 
I know I've made mistakes, and I know I haven't always been the easiest person to understand, but I'm committed to making things right. I want to move forward with you, to reconnect in a deeper way, and to create a future that's filled with love, joy, and fulfillment for both of us. You are incredibly important to me, and I hope you can see that, even when my actions haven't always reflected it. Our journey together is far from over, and I believe that the best is yet to come. I'm ready to put in the work to ensure that we manifest the dream life we've always envisioned together.